We love singing the gestures of recognition of minivans, and the 2024 Kia Amusement Park gives us a lot to murmur about. In addition to the fact that it is functional, agreeable, and esteem-pressed, however, it likewise wears an attractive SUV-enlivened look that assists van-opposed drivers with staying away from the flinch. Its blocky, upstanding plan really does its best impression of Kia's uber-beneficial Telluride SUV. However, investigate and you'll find more to like in the fare. Minivan opponents, for example, the Chrysler Pacifica and the Honda Odyssey are marginally roomier. However, the amusement park's low burden floor and tall rooftop give a lot of room to the typical family's requirements. Settle on the second line celebrity seats and the festival is changed into extravagance travel with leaning back containers planned to make travels with unpleasant children a breeze. All models come stacked with driver help elements and present-day infotainment as well. Maybe the main drawback is the van's front-wheel drive just format. Yet we found that the 290 HP V6 motor and a bunch of winter tires will put the festival on balance with AWD rivals while the going gets blanketed. The fair, as well as each of the three of its opponents, is a 2024 Editor's Decision honoree. The festival sees just two minor changes for 2024, and both affect the EX trim as it were. This mid-range trim no longer accompanies auto up-down power windows, however, it incorporates a powerwork backlift gate. The cost of the 2024 Kia Festival begins at $34,995 and goes up to $48,095, relying upon the trim and options. The fair is presented in four trim levels going from the Worth Situated LX to the Grand SX Distinction, yet the EX addresses the perfect balance among highlights and cost. The EX trim accompanies a few comfort, includes that assistance to legitimize the expense of overhauling, including a power-worked backlift gate, an in-lodge radio, and a voice control framework that permits backseat travelers to give orders to the festival's infotainment system. The fair is fueled by a 3.5-liter V6, producing a solid 290 HP. An 8-speed program transmission is standard. All-wheel drive isn't on the menu, as the festival is presented as a front-wheel drive model, as it were. The Pacifica has a discretionary module half-and-half -half powertrain, and the Toyota Sienna comes as a crossover naturally, yet no such arrangement is presented on the fair. We're dazzled by the fair's even ride and taking care of, which is smooth while cruising yet made in corners. The refined V6 motor gives sporty speed increase and fueled the amusement park to 60 p in 7.0 seconds at our test track.